Man, I'm really enjoying these potatoes. I have no idea why. Teh, <laughs> time to get some food for the village. Wait, this is gonna be delicious. <laughs> my, my, my parents! What, why'd you say my- what? Technoblade's grandfather, who only lives a few blocks away, heard all the screaming. So, he got his wood sword out of his chest and went to go see what was happening. What could be happening in there? I must go see what's going on. Grandson, what's the screaming for? And where are your parents? This evil villager dude kinda just slaughtered my parents with pork chops, so... Come with me. So, Baby Techno went with his grandfather to his house. Grandson, get some rest now. You've had a rough day. Over the years, Technoblade learned the basics of Minecraft. Technoblade became a professional builder. He also became a professional miner. And for some reason, he fell in love with eating potatoes. I honestly have no idea why. Hey dude, I see you're selling potatoes. What's the price? Hey, you customer, yo. That'll be 10 diamonds for 100 potatoes on the dot. Yo, bet. I got 10 diamonds on me. All right, here are your potatoes. You only gave me five potatoes. Oh my goodness. Why do I get scammed every day? Bro, this nerd just got scammed. Grandpa. I've had this anger that's been building up inside of me for years now. Because I want to know who slaughtered my parents so poor chop. I want revenge. I'll tell you who slaughtered your family, but we trained first. So, Technoblade's grandfather took Techno to his dojo where he has been training for many, many years. If you show me you're a warrior, I will tell you who slaughtered your parents. And you will receive a sword that has been passed down through many of our generations. The Orphan Obliterator. So, Technoblade got his training gear on and was ready to train with his grandfather. They began to train, Technoblade's grandfather training Techno on every aspect in Minecraft. Technoblade learned how to fight, he also became a parkour master. And his grandfather even taught him how to farm potatoes, I guess that was supposed to help him in training. You show him everything you've got, and don't give up. Technoblade was finally prepared for revenge. Grandson, we need to talk. Grandson, it's time I tell you. Who slaughtered your family. The man who slaughtered your family stole something from me that I could never forget. One day, I just came home from a mining trip. Oh man, that was a very successful mining trip, man. Oh my gosh, I have so many stacks of diamonds. This took so many hours. Oh my goodness. Hey there, pig. Give me your money right now. Okay, chill, dude. I oh my gosh, dude, I worked so hard for these diamonds. Here, take them. <laughs> Let's go, baby. That's another person robbed. See you later, man. I put so much hard work and hours into finding those diamonds. I wanted revenge. What happened to my village? Who could have done this? <laughs> They're not gonna get away with it. I'm the one that burnt your village down to the ground because you slaughtered my family right in front of my eyes. <laughs> I don't care about your stupid diamonds. You messed with the wrong person, pig. Grandson, it's time you take the orphan obliterator. You've earned it. You're a warrior. Grandson, good luck on your journey. This village is now under my control, you nerds. I don't think so, pig. You don't stand a chance against me. This nerd really thinks he can defeat me. Little does he know, I am Technoblade. Oh my gosh, pig. You're really making a fool of yourself right now. Never mind. You know what? You know what? I accept defeat. Yeah, pig, you really do look like a fool now. You just lost the battle. Now, I'm gonna shoot you with this crossbow, and you're gonna die. Hold on, don't kill him. What? Why, master? He literally killed the entire village. Leave him with me. He's gonna be in prison for the rest of his life. Tch! <laughs> Go, you stupid pig. Hurry up. I don't got all day. Hey, chill, villager. Alright, alright, you can chill. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whoa, this prison cell's a bit intimidating, actually. Holy... This is what happens when he messed with the wrong villager. You killed my village. Now, you're gonna be in here for the rest of your life. Tch! <laughs> my grandson hasn't returned in weeks. There's definitely something wrong. He might be trapped. He might be dead. I must get prepared to go save my grandson. That evil villager won't kill him. I'm gonna kill the evil villager. Hey, let's go. I found the village. What is that nether portal doing there? 
That must be where my grandson is. Why are these villagers all standing still? Uh, I'm not gonna worry about it. Alright, I'm prepared to enter. Wait, what does this book say? Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna worry about it. Alright, grandson. I'm coming to save you. Grandson, I'm here to free you from the evil villager that put you in this prison. Come on, let's get out. I don't think so, old looking pig. What do you think you're doing here? Oh, nothing. I'm just here to free my grandson. You put him in this prison. Now, if you want to fight, you don't stand a chance. You have no armor! Ah, oh, my goodness, you stupid pig. You really think I wouldn't come here with full netherite armor? Listen to me, you're gonna die. Okay, I didn't expect you to have full netherite armor, but I'm ready to fight. Let's do this! Grandson, I'm only on half a heart. He broke my armor, and he took my weapon. But I want you to take this ender pearl and escape from this evil prison. Grandson, this is gonna be the last time we speak. Goodbye. It's unfortunate that Techno's grandfather got slaughtered. Technoblade decided to make his great escape, escaping that prison and getting the heck out of Dodge. But Technoblade found something very interesting during his escape. Whoa, wait, this is like actually pretty cool for, you know, my standards. I guess I'll go down here. Huh? Wait, what are those potions? I'm a little bit intimidated by this a little bit. Ooh, this looks healthy. Hey. What happened to me? Oh, oh, I look so handsome. Oh my, I feel muscular, more powerful. Hey pig, get out of my laboratory. Oh no, he actually drank the blood god potion. It's not even tested yet. All right, you know what? I'm out. How did that lightning bolt get me out? One sec. Ooh, this is pretty nice. I got super pig abilities. You know what? I got an idea. <laughs> Time to get some food for the village. This is going to be delicious. <laughs> Wait, what the heck? Oh my god, please, don't kill me, man, please, please, somebody kill me, please, no! Not even close, baby, Technoblade never dies! I escaped that pig. He didn't stand a chance against me. I'm undefeatable, unkillable. Okay, what's in here? Oh, hello there, weird-looking scientist. What are you doing in my lab, you villager? Get out! Oh, nothing, I just came in here to see what was going on. I just escaped this crazy pig dude that was trying to kill me. I'll pay you. Over a million dollars. If you create something that can kill something that's almost unkillable. Yes, of course. Follow me this way. What is this? It's just a normal human being. I don't get it. Ha ah, ah, ha ah. ha. This is my evil science experiment. The dream project. This thing is going to be undefeatable. Very intelligent and quick. Listen to me, man. I don't know why I'm here. I don't even know why you had to put me in the cell. But please don't run any stupid science experiments on me, alright? Alright, George, I think this might be the best place to stay for tonight. Let's set up camp here. Uh, George, who are you talking to? What? Oh my god! Where did you go? Who the heck are you? Don't worry about it, you filthy human. You're gonna be a part of my experiment. The Dream Project. Wait, what? Oh my goodness. Did I get knocked out or something? What is going on? I can't remember anything. Oh, hello, my experiment. How do you feel? Oh, hey, master. I'm feeling great. Ha, ha, ha. The potion is working. The superhuman ability should kick in in the next few days. Anyhow, follow me this way, dream. You see this pig right here? He's worth one million dollars. If you kill him, I'll get the money. Ooh, one million dollars? That pig's gonna be bacon. Your superpowers haven't activated quite yet, but you need to learn how to hone your abilities. Sensei! Hello, Dr. Gamer. How may I assist you? Train this kid for me to kill this pig. You'll get 50 grand. As you wish. Okay, my student. Training begins! So, Dream put his training gear on and was ready to train with his sensei. They began to train. Dream sensei training Dream on every strategy in Minecraft. Dream learned how to fight. He also came up with several deadly traps that he can use to absolutely outsmart and embarrass his enemies. Sensei trained him on adapting his survival skills and to use anything in his surroundings to his advantage. And we all know Dream is an absolute beast at clutching. He mastered every clutch there is in Minecraft. Dream was a smart guy, so not only did he train on his clutching skills and Minecraft ability, he studied every Minecraft strategy in the books. Now, Dream's superhuman abilities should activate very soon. Sensei, how is the training progress going with your new student? His skills are developing faster than any other student I've trained. It's phenomenal. Sensei, I can explain why he's developing so quickly. I gave him a potion that gives him superhuman abilities. I call it 
the dream project. Okay, training's done for the day. Now, I just gotta study and head to bed. Whoa, what the heck was that? What happened to me? Student, are you okay? What happened? Who are you? And what did you do with my student? Uh, Sensei, it's me. My superhuman abilities have finally activated. I can now destroy Technoblade. Okay, I see. Let's see what you can do with your superhuman abilities. Okay, horse. I don't think you're ready for this race. I'm gonna blow you out. Alright, three, two, one, go! Bring me the dragon egg. Yes, Sensei. How did you beat the Ender Dragon that fast? Eh, it was pretty easy. 420 times 69. 28,980. 1,589 times 390. 619,710. I see you've returned. Is the training complete? Yes, sir. And I'm ready to turn that pig into bacon. I like the confidence. Get some rest. Tomorrow you have a big day. Okay, bet. They really think they can kill Technoblade? It's not that easy. I gotta go let him know. Sir Techno, I have some crazy news. Oh, sorry, you must have been farming potatoes. But the scientists and Green Blob want you dead. And they're at the big laboratory. You gotta go kill them before they come over here. Oh, I see you're prepared. Well, good luck, Techno. Okay, Master, I'm ready to- What the heck happened to you? Why do you look so much different? Hello, my creation. The reason I created you was to defeat Technoblade for one million dollars. But Technoblade is more powerful than we think. The Blood God Potion is the most deadly experiment I've created. I drank the Beast Potion just in case. Now go kill the Blade, and once he's finished, bring him to me. How did a pig get inside of our laboratory? What the heck? Anyways, well, 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 look who we have here. The stupid little pig known as Technoblade. This is the last time you're gonna see the Earth. You're going down, Techno! Well, 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 look who we have here, the stupid little pig known as Technoblade. This is the last time you're gonna see the Earth. You're going down, Techno! When I grew up, I had no idea what I wanted to be. I tried several jobs like farming and fishing, but none of those jobs were meant for me. And I was just a kid, so I had a while to make this decision. But the one thing I wanted to be... I couldn't. You know what, mom? When I grow up, I want to be a famous YouTuber or some sort of scientist. We talked about this, Jimmy. You can only become a farmer or a blacksmith. Village rules. Ah, oh, I hate living in this village. I can never do what I want to do. I'm going to Chris's house. Hey, Chris, want to start a business with me? I promise we will make thousands of dollars. Jimmy, remember the village rules? We can only be villager jobs, but you know what? I'm down. Let's do this. So, they began their business, Jimmy and Chris filming videos for other villagers in the village to watch, and it was actually working out pretty well until... Bro, we've made so many emeralds from our business. I know, right? We're gonna be rich. Jimmy, for God's sake, we've talked about making videos. You're meant to be a farmer or a blacksmith, not some stupid YouTuber. That's it. I'm burning all the money you've earned. Why are you doing this? Why did you do that? We spent months on this business. That's it. I'm leaving this village forever. Come on, Chris. Let's go. Jimmy, my family is here. I can't leave them behind. Okay, Chris. Once our business makes millions, I'll come back and get you. Don't worry about your son. He'll return in the next few days, hopefully. Thank you, sir. You've always been a great village leader. So, Jimmy began his quest on becoming the richest man in Minecraft. But, Jimmy had no home, so he built himself a nice house and an animal farm for food. Jimmy also trained himself on the ways of Minecraft and how to PvP. After a few weeks, Jimmy started his business, which was Mr. Beastburger, and he was making a good amount of money from it. Every day, there would be at least 20 customers waiting to have a Beastburger. Hey dude, I see you're selling Mr. Beast Burgers. What's the price? Uh, that'll be three emeralds for one Mr. Beast Burger. Bet, I got three emeralds on me right now. Here you go. Alright bro, have a good day. Man, today was such a busy day. Time to head to bed. Jimmy, I have bad news. Chris, what are you doing here? It's been months, what's going on? This pig is killing everybody in our village. We need to do something about it, Jimmy. What? I'm getting all my gear on and heading to the village. Follow me. So... Jimmy and Chris got on their horses and went to the village.
Chris, you gotta listen to me. Go hide in one of these villager houses, and don't come out until I say it's safe. What did this pig do to these villagers? What the heck? What do you think you're doing, pig man? Get out of my village. Leave, or we fight to the death. What are you looking at, pig? Oh, crap! That sword does a lot of damage. But you know what? I didn't come here to back down. Okay, yeah, I gotta take cover. Sorry to bother you, master, but a pigman is invading our village. Shall I go kill the animal? No, get him to half a heart, and once he's gave up, bring him to me. Yes, sir. Wow, that pig almost killed Jimmy. If I had the gear, I could beat the crap out of that pig. You know, I shouldn't have said that. Now he's gonna come and kill me. Okay, pig, you caught me. But I have a deal we can agree on. If I give you 100 emeralds, don't kill me. How does that sound? Wait, no! Oh my god, did he really just kill my best friend? That's it, I'm coming to kill you! Watch out, kid. I'm gonna go take care of this pig, but I want you to go head to safety. Understand? Jimmy couldn't believe what just happened to Chris. He ran away and locked himself in his house for weeks to create a plan to get revenge on Technoblade. One month later, Jimmy became a mad scientist and built the biggest laboratory in Minecraft. Jimmy created several experiments that could potentially kill Technoblade, but none of those projects were close to the power of the Dream Project. Yes, this experiment is going to destroy Technoblade. He won't stand a chance. Wait a second, is that my village leader? I have to act like I don't know him. Oh, hello there, weird-looking scientist. What are you doing in my lab, you villager? Get out! Oh, nothing. I just came in here to see what was going on. I just escaped this crazy pig dude that was trying to kill me. I'll pay you over a million dollars if you create something that can kill something that's almost unkillable. Yes, of course. Follow me this way. So Jimmy showed the evil villager the dream project, and if this dream project can kill Technoblade, Jimmy will be the richest man in Minecraft. So, Jimmy got to work on the dream project, and it was coming along pretty successful. He could potentially defeat Technoblade. I see you've returned. Is the training complete? Yes, and I'm ready to turn that pig into bacon. I like the confidence. Go get some rest. Tomorrow you have a big day. Okay, Dream. Good luck on defeating Technoblade. Alright, time to get some sleep. I've had a very long day. Hey, what are you doing in my lab? I'm sorry, Technoblade, but you're going down. You don't stand a chance. Oh, hello, Jimmy. I forgot to mention, but if your Dream Project doesn't kill Technoblade, I will kill you! You little nerd, haha, <laughs> you're so weak, Technoblade never dies. Oh wow, I see how it is. I thought we were a team, working together. Honestly, Technoblade, I don't even know why you're fighting me at this point. You're gonna die! Just give up, you stupid pig, alright? You know, whatever, it's fine, because my dream project's gonna win anyways. I'll be right back. I can't believe that villager would say that. Wait, what? You two have been fighting in my laboratory this whole time? Keep fighting him, Dream! Come on! Oh my god, this guy's finally accepted defeat. There was no competition at all. How could you give up? Kill him! He's worth a million dollars! The pig thinks I gave up, but no. Master, there is something I didn't tell you about my powers. What the heck? The night before the Dream vs. Technoblade fight, there were two scientists evil scientists working on the deadliest minecraft experiment that could possibly change minecraft forever hey jerry how's it going over there with the experiment it's going well the experiment is almost complete master will be pleased hello gentlemen is the project complete yes sir we just finished it have a look very well this better please my likings i'm paying you both a lot of money wow villager man you betrayed us both of us and mr beast were gonna take down technoblade together Oh, shut up, Dream. You know I only do this for the money. If this experiment works out, my old orphan village will be so proud of me. I bet they would be very proud, sir. You can do the honors of giving our subject the potion. With pleasure, Doc. Can't wait to see how this turns out. Ha! <laughs> ha! Okay, let's see how this experiment turned out. Wait a second, where's the test subject? Oh no, the test subject must have escaped! Now we're not gonna get the money we deserve! Wait a second, what was that noise? Oh my gosh! Dream, what happened to you? The experiment must have gone wrong! No! <laughs> Alright, ch chill out. I, I have a family!
Man, today is such a wonderful day to farm me some potatoes. Oh my goodness, these are going to be delicious. And of course, it starts to rain as I'm farming my potatoes. Oh my goodness, this is absolutely ridiculous. Anyways, wait, what was that? Oh my goodness, did I really just get scammed again? And now look, villager, it starts to rain because of you. You always scam me when I come by your shop. Never coming here again, by the way. Wait a second. Was that the Flash? Dude, I actually didn't know he was in Minecraft, dude. That's actually insane. Ha ha ha, I finally made it to the lab. Now it's time to control this world forever. But I must disguise this dream right now. Hold on, Technoblade. Before we continue fighting, I just want to mention... I don't think I properly introduced myself. What are you two doing in my lab and dream? What happened to you? Jimmy, you really thought I was on your side this entire time? Me and the evil villager are now working together to take over this world. Wait, you and the evil villager are working together? Oh my god! What did you just do to Technoblade? Where did he go? Jimmy, just shut up and listen. The evil villager and I are going to take over this world. Oh my god, what happened to me? I can't remember anything. What is this place? Villager man, what are you doing here? Oh my goodness, Jimmy, you are such an idiot! You really thought it was working with you this entire time? You fool. Me and my team of scientists have been creating the deadliest Minecraft experiment, the Mind Controller. And anybody affected by that experiment will be under my control forever. And that's what we did to Dream. He's under my control forever. I have over 100 of these potions stored in a secret lab that you will never find. Goodbye, Jimmy. I must find a way to get to those potions. Haha, <laughs> Jimmy is such an idiot. Okay, this is my chance. I could really use a Mr. Beast Burger right now. Sensei? Oh my god, Master, what did the villager do to you? Are you hurt? I'm gonna break you out of this prison, don't worry. Oh no, he's here! Oh my god, is that you, Dream? What happened to you? Oh, you must not be caught up on the news yet. I'm under the villager's control forever. Jimmy, what is he talking about? Sensei, he's under the villager's control. You must kill him right now. Yes, sir. Alright, Dream, you were my best student, and I trained you to be the best as you could be. But that comes to an end today! Wait, what the heck? Dream, what are you doing to me? Oh my god! Put me down now! I'm sorry, Sensei. I do remember you. Sadly, I really don't care, and I just want to take over this world. Oh my god! Oh my goodness! What the heck just happened to me? Wait a second. What is this lever doing here? Whoa, whoa, where am I? What is this place? What are all these cells doing here? Wait a second. Project not found? Don't tell me. George, what are you doing in here? Oh my god, how did you find me? It doesn't matter. George, why were you in this cell? Nightmare Trap, all of Mr. Beast's experiments in these cells, including me. So we're calling him Nightmare now? Okay, I'm getting everybody out of these cells. Don't. If Nightmare finds out we escaped, he will kill us. But follow me over here. There's something I need to show you. A couple days ago, I found out Nightmare's weakness is diamonds. Take the diamonds and you kill that evil beast. Oh my god, George, you're a genius! I'm surprised that netherite won't kill Nightmare. Anyways, I'ma get the diamonds. Thank you, George. Alright, George. Thank you for the diamonds. I really appreciate it. After we defeat Nightmare, I will come back and free all of you guys. Oh, that was quick. Alright, it's time to go free Mr. Beast from the prison. And we will defeat Nightmare once and for all. Alright, let's end this. Alright, Jimmy. I'm here to free you from the prison. Oh my god. Thank you, Sensei. I found out that Nightmare's weakness is diamonds, and we can take him down. Sensei, let's take down Nightmare! So, Techno, who put you in this prison? I'm here to get you out. Bro, this little guy called Dream teleported me in here or something. I don't know what's going on. Don't worry, Techno. Let's go home. Thank you. I actually really appreciate that. Anyways, you just got scammed. See you later! Hey, wait for me! Ooh, Sensei, you were looking fresh in that diamond armor. Okay, let's go take down Nightmare, shall we? Alright, Sensei, let's do this! Wait a second! Technoblade, what are you doing here? 
Hey, 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 don't fire, don't fire. I want to help you take down this dream dude. He's extremely annoying. How can I trust you? You destroyed my village and killed my best friend. Listen, listen. The village you're controlling, Dream, killed my family when I was a child, and I want revenge. Alright then, let's do this, but let's get you geared up first. Alright everybody, we have found the evil villagers base. ATTACK! They have security guards. Doesn't matter, eliminate them now! Alright, well we're here to stop you once and for all. Villager, I have three men here to stop you. Now tell us where the potions are right now. And why would I do that? That would be hard work going to waste. Well, we have three crossbows pointing at you and full enchanted diamond armor, which is Nightmare's weakness. Tell us or die. I cannot do that. Understand? All right, dudes, this villager killed my family when I was a child, back when I had a great life, and now I'm an orphan. I'll kill him. Wait, 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 Techno, do you understand how rich we could be if you join me? You're dead. Later. No! Okay, where's Nightmare? Oh, there he is. Oh, hello, guys. By the way, how did you find me? Anyways, I'm about to kill you. Wait a second. I can't use my superpowers. What's going on? We found your weakness. It's diamonds. And you won't be able to do anything anymore. Understand? You'll be coming with us and you will be in prison for the rest of your life. After that, Dream was put behind bars for the rest of his life. Technoblade continued farming potatoes for a living. Sensei trained himself to become the greatest Minecraft player of all time. And finally, Mr. Beast continued his business, Mr. Beast Burger. And that, my friends, was the story of Minecraft's Masters. Oh my god, I think I lost him. I need to find some shelter, some cover. What is that? I guess I can hide over there. Hmm, something seems off about this place, but I gotta hide ASAP. I have no time to waste. Maybe there is something in these chests. Okay, there's some potions in these chests? You know, I could really use anything to fight off this beast.